And now, with the area's certified most accurate forecast seven years in a row, meteorologist Jeff Andrews. Well, glad you're with us. Had a nice sunset shot just a few minutes ago in Green Bay, but you know, things have clouded up a bit. That's what we're going to see, a little more cloud cover as we head into the evening. 33 degrees right now. The winds are going to lighten up, though, and we'll see a little bit of clearing but uh, it's going to be pretty brief. We'll cloud back up real quick as we get into tomorrow. I'll show you that in just a moment. Manitowoc right now, mainly cloudy skies. Actually, not as cloudy as Green Bay. We're looking at 34 right now. As far as Appleton, 34 degrees as well. And a little bit of sunshine. You see the blue sky, but really it's been a pretty cloudy day overall for all of us. Now, we're expecting things quiet as we get into the evening. Maybe some flurries around a light snow in the forecast as we get into your Thursday. Most of the accumulation quite a ways north. And really, it's, we're only looking at kind of a dusting. A nice weekend, then a major Arctic blast as we get into next week. I'll show you what we're looking at for temperatures in just a moment. As far as our snow chances for tomorrow, fairly low. We get into uh, Sunday, the same situation. Better chance of seeing something add up as we you know, get into Monday. Tuesday, just a slight chance. Here's our cloud cover mainly northwest to southeast right now. As far as our temperatures, 33, winds are west, 13 miles an hour. It's been a little breezy this afternoon for some locations. We go into the evening, we remain cloudy. The winds actually start to die down a bit. Really, it's more the wind gusts that have kind of been a little bit of an annoyance as we went through the day today. Temperatures aren't going to drop off a whole lot. As far as the gusts, now here's a look at 5 this evening. You can still see west winds gusting upwards at 25 miles an hour. As we get towards 11 o'clock this evening, still westerly direction, but the gusts aren't really prevalent at that point. And by tomorrow morning, we're seeing things pretty calm. That's the way our Thursday is looking as far as our winds. Overnight tonight, we're not going to drop off a whole lot. O'Connell, Green Bay. 25, Sturgeon Bay, Algoma, about 26 for the overnight, primarily mid and upper 20s. Future cast showing quite a bit of cloud cover. It's passing here and there. Here's a look at 10 o'clock this evening. We start to see some clearing at that point. And as you see, it clouds up pretty quick again as we get into your Thursday morning around 8 o'clock. And here's a look at 5 o'clock, end of the typical work day. We see a line of light snow, really in the form of a dust in our expectations as we get towards the later part of Thursday. But you see by 10 o'clock, it pretty well blows through fairly quick as we uh, get into the later part of the evening on your Thursday. Looking ahead to sunshine, now as far as uh, the snowfall totals here, you see it's just really dusting what we're looking at. Your temperature trend over the next 10 days or so, not a bad uh, you know, stretch here the first handful of days, but look as we get into next week, showing four for the potential high next Wednesday. For tonight, cloudy flurries, middle, upper 20s for the most part, 27 at the Lakeshore, 25 Green Bay in the Fox Valley. For tomorrow, cloudy light snow developing later on in the afternoon. Most of it's going to be to the north, and as far as accumulations, very little uh, possibility of an inch or so north of Green Bay, more so as you go further north, but even then it's still not a whole lot. Now your seven-day planner, cloudy snow showers uh, as we get into Friday. Now Saturday, Sunday, we're looking at some milder temperatures, a little sunshine by 40, or by Sunday rather, Chris, how uh, about 40 degrees? Not bad, I'll take it. <laughs> Uh, what's your favorite part on there? The four degrees on Wednesday? <laughs> it's the 40 degrees yeah. on Wednesday, yeah. yeah. All right. Uh, we thank you so very much. All right.